Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to some more Terra Genesis episode 4 with the series here. And I've gone ahead, I've been doing some a few things off camera, not a whole lot. But, ah oh, dang, I would love to have taken those. I've gotten up to 52 Genesis points, which is great. I'm going to keep pushing for Genesis points as much as possible. But, um, yeah, let's go through and, and see what we've got here. So, uh, I did go ahead and go get the carbon fixture, which is good. We're going to be building that. The aquifer um, network I want to build next. I did research the HAB complex and then I went ahead and grabbed all of the mining resources because that's always pretty important. So let's go ahead and actually research the aquifer network. That's going to be one of our next big things. And going here, you'll see that I made another uh, colony. I haven't built anything here aside from the carbon fixer, so let me actually show what I've done. I've got the one carbon fixer, which was minus 40 oxygen plus 10 pressure. If I go to my other colony, I've built... Um, I've built the three bio fixture labs. i got to get one more up, so we're actually losing... 10 oxygen right now, which is fine because we can stand or lose it for a little bit. We were almost capped out anyways. Pressure has just finally hit 8 million, so we're a little ways off on that. And the temperature keeps going down as the atmosphere thins, which is great. Water is up. Um, not at all, so that's fine as well. All right, so what we need to do here is we first we need to get a... We need to get a, we need to, honestly, we need to get rid of one of these as much as it sucks. Um, which might make us lose something here. We'll find out as soon as I demolish this. Maybe not. We got need the one space because we're going to build a HAB complex. Got to get a HAB complex here, which is going to give us oxygen anyways. Um, actually, so maybe if that's going to give us oxygen, that'll put us at zero. So maybe I don't want to build another bio fixture lab, but I kind of needed to. So I'll have to think that through. Um, I'll probably end up getting an O2 filter to offset that. Um, not a big deal. The next facility is at pop a thousand. So that's going to give me 2,500. I'll probably build one more bio fixture lab. Give me the extra oxygen. And then I'll build the O2 filter to offset the oxygen for that um, that'll be fine I think going here I'm gonna want to build another one as well so maybe if I'm gonna build a bunch of hab complexes I'll just build another carbon fixer that might work no no it's got to be the O2 filter it's got to be because I can't have any negative modifiers for it. So we may as well just build an O2 filter here. Uh, I generally like to put it in the colony that it's got to go in though. But I'll build one here because I'm going to end up building a HAB complex here anyways. Um, I'd really like to get a HAB dome. I'd like to work on the HAB dome though. So we'll just get the one O2 filter up. We'll kind of play around with it a little bit. How are we doing on the mining here? I think I went ahead and I found a couple different... Yeah, I found a couple different things. I thought about getting one more outpost set up. I think I've mined this for any like really rich resources. You know, there's a few spots that are still okay, but I haven't found like any like um, any really big rhodium spots. That's not bad. It's it's a million though, and then you only end up getting you know three thousand for the next two days or whatever. So it's not bad, but still. Oh, good silver. Nine days, so that's gonna give us a lot. That was a good boost. Um, do we have any culture points? I haven't checked. No. 
but we're already up pretty high because I've been dumping any culture points I get into that. We're 25% victory. So you see oxygen's almost where it needs to be. It's not in a bad place. It's just going to be getting the other stuff down. The pressure is going to be the hardest. Oxygen was almost perfect at one point, but I had to do that or I was going to run past it too quickly. I've been getting a lot more Genesis points lately on um, pop-ups for them, and I don't know why. Yeah, so we'll get the Hab Complex. That'll allow us to build one more biofixture lab, and then I'll need a biofixture lab here, and I'll need a O2 filter here if I'm going to offset that. And well, let's see, the aquifer network eventually... But if I'm going to do the hab dome, that's oxygen and water. So eventually I need the geocistern to offset those because I've got to hit certain population amounts. If I'm going to see victory. So I'm going to want to research that. What's it take to hurry this? 11. I don't know if I spend. I don't want to start spending Genesis points just yet. I'm saving those for a rainy day. You know, eventually once I get to the later stuff, I'm going to want to start rushing some of that. And I, I have spent them a little bit to rush certain things. I may actually rush the Hab Complex for it. Because why not? If you look at C3 Genesis points. Oh, my God. Like... It's nuts. I'm going to stop clicking on those and say, try to save them for the end of the video, but I doubt I'll get another three Genesis points one. But I don't want to... Uh, I don't want to waste any time here. I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to hurry this. Confirm. Only four Genesis points. So that gives me the Hab Complex. So we should start seeing the population go up, especially because of uh, this here. Oops. So we'll start seeing that go once it hits a thousand, which is what I'm going to wait for. I'm not going to wait right now, but um, later tonight I'll log back in and I'll check on it. I'll get my next bio fixture lab. Cool. I'll let it, uh, yeah, I'll let it. Go up there, I'll get my other biofixture lab. So let's see. Biofixture lab is gonna be 40 oxygen plus the 10 here. So what are we doing for oxygen now? We should be, if I'm correct, we should be zeroed out. Yes. So once I get the other biofixture lab, we'll be back to plus 10, which is fine. I'm gonna let that build up. I'm gonna get the O2 filter here. I'm not gonna click on that one now. I'm gonna get the O2 filter here. And then that O2 filter will cancel out the HAB complex. But as I slowly upgrade it, I'll upgrade it to cancel out the plus 10 oxygen once we get really close to the perfect oxygen level. So that's going to work out great. And then for this other colony here, um, I guess, what am I building? The O2 filter, which is fine. I'm going to do the O2 filter and go ahead. I either do a hab, hab complex or wait for the hab dome. I probably should research the hab dome next. Um, I could use the water. The plus, the the um, O2 filter still cancel out, cancels out the plus 10 oxygen, but it's a lot more citizens. I shouldn't waste my money or time building the hab complexes anywhere else because the hab dome, they'll all eventually have to be torn down and turned into hab domes. If I'm ever going to get enough population to get more culture points. So I guess that's where I'll leave it off. Yeah, so that looks good. So that kind of gives you guys an idea of where we're at and where we're going. So hopefully by the time the next time we come around here, I'll have the oxygen all leveled out. And I'll be able to show you guys how that looks. And maybe we'll see pressure, you know, another 500,000 down or so. Maybe a little bit more because I'll have another biofixture lab. And we will probably see 
start the transition of switching over to hab domes. So we'll see that as well, and maybe even getting a third colony up. I'm probably gonna be pretty close to that too. Maybe even a second outpost. I don't know. We'll see where we're we'll see where we're at. But I thank you all for joining me. I do hope that you've enjoyed it, and I look forward to seeing you next time.